Hello, seniors. Hey, so this is Mr. Quinn, and I'm going to do a quick run through on uh, four, actually three different websites you can use to try and look for some of your research. Okay, the first one is kind of like not, not the best one, I would say. It's called JSTOR. So you just get it from the URL, which is JSTOR.org. Okay, and let's say I've got a search planned and I've got to look for something about Nicaragua health statistics. Okay. Okay, so great. It's got about 6,800 results. That's fantastic. But if I find something, let's say this is the one I really think is the best, and I want to try to click download. Uh oh, I get that. Nope, no can do. All right, so let's see what we can actually get. Okay, you scroll down on the left side and you click this content I can access. Okay, so that gets it down to 294. All right, so let's say some of these are, are, are valid for our thesis and we need to do some research to support our ideas. Okay, and let's say that this one looks good, okay? I can click download PDF and I can get this article called Traditional and Modern Cohabitation in Latin America, a Comparative Typology. And this is from Demographic Research Magazine, okay? I'm sure it's a real nail biter. And it's from January 2015 and it's on these pages, okay? So you already know how to cite this. This has open access, so you can download the PDF, okay? All right, let's look at the next one. We'll do the same search on the next one. This is PubMed, okay? This is the U.S. government. This is the National Library of Medicine, National Institutes of Health, okay? This has way more uh, citations, okay? And way more free sources that you can download, okay? So let's do the same search and see what we get. Okay. All right. Actually, in this case, uh, you know, your mileage may vary, right? This only has 182. Okay. Results. And so here's one talking about HIV drug resistance. Okay. This one's about something called global respiratory synctial virus. Okay. As you see, these are much more very much health oriented and very specific with uh, national health. Okay, so let's say, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. okay, risk factors for norovirus gastroenteritis. Okay, now this one, uh oh, we're not going to be able to download that. Why? Because I don't have this little button here, this little text that says, free PMC article, okay? So this one we can get. So if it does say free, free PMC article or free article like this one, okay? Those are ones that you can access, all right? Without having to have a, um, you know, some sort of payment situation or be associated. So let's say this was what we wanted. We could look at this and find out the background, the abstract, and we can look at it and go, hmm, you know, is this what I'm, I'm looking at? Okay, it's in Managua, two hospitals, 2014. Okay, they're observing if we do flu vaccines during pregnancy, if that actually reduces the risk of influenza in pregnant women and their offspring. Okay, so this is something we want. Great, fantastic. All right, what do I do? Here's our links, here's our full text links, okay? So this is from some other site, El Savior Science, and then this is the PMC, I would recommend normally clicking that, okay? All right, so this is going to get it, and you can, this is the whole, this is the whole, this is the whole research paper right here, okay? All right, you can download it, okay? You can do an EPUB if you want to read it on your phone, for example, 
Okay? Or we can just look at it here. All right. Okay, so the third one, finally, we're going to show Google Scholar. Okay, now Google Scholar is cool. Um, let's just search the same terms. Okay, now this is a lot broader. Okay, it's not necessarily that it's going to have something um, really official. It might not even be an actual uh, real study, let's say. It may actually may be something that just some copywriter wrote and it made it look like it was an actual uh, scholarly article, and it may not. But these are all available freely, okay? And in this case, look, you got 97,400, but you have to be a little bit more discriminatory about this, okay? So, um, okay, let's say, let's look for something specifically Nicaragua related. Okay. Uh, okay, let's say if you were, this is not very recent, but this would be interesting to you maybe if you were doing a study on the effects of the Nicaraguan revolution, okay? And you just give it a click there. And this is going to go to what looks like an article. Hopefully it's still active. Okay. All right. And you can get the PDF from here. Okay. All right. And I'm going to also give you the URL for two different articles to look at. This one is uh, just one I found that was useful. TannerHelen.com and how to access science and medical research without paying an arm and a leg for it. So this has other links besides the three that I've talked about. And then this is another good one too. This is phppartners.org. And this is how to access journal articles. Okay, so this talks about what we've looked at before, plus some other ones. Um, education, the Eric one, which is for education. The public health, okay. Um, PMC, we've just looked at, Pub Medical. Okay, and then this is another one, okay. And there's some here that are repositories from universities uh, or other special places to get stuff, okay. All right, so those are your, your tips. And as always, let me know if I can be 